Hello, hello, and Happy New Year. This is Donna. It's January the 6th, 2010, or 2010. I, I can't, I haven't figured out yet which I'll use more, probably 2010, but, um, welcome to my first video blog of the new year, my first video blog of a long time, actually. And I don't plan it to be a long one, um, I do expect to do more of these this year. Um, I had been trying to use all kinds of tools and I have to perfect how this works to make it easy. Easy is important um, in making things happen. So I've been trying to upload them from my computer, but Facebook is always busy and YouTube doesn't seem to want to behave. So I am using my flip a little flip and Lord knows I can't see what I'm shooting so as I'm looking at this little teeny weeny camera and I could be I could be like up here I could be down here I don't know um, which is one of the reasons why this will be short because it would be a shame to spend too much time um, and find that it's just not visually interesting but I did want to share a couple of things. I wanted to say hello. I wanted to let people know that I'm doing good, that I'm fine, that uh, life is good. And um, I am here today in South Carolina. Started the week in, um, in Dallas. I spent Christmas with mom in, in the snow. It's cold, lots of snow. Um, most since they've had there in Dallas since 1926 on Christmas way. And I know people love what Christmas is. It's got some sense of allure to it, to a lot of people, but not to this person. So it was nice to look at. I had to fly, I had to land, I had to travel, which was a little bit of a challenge. But I made it, and it didn't cause too much havoc in my world. I didn't get stuck in an airport, and my heart goes out to people who did. So... Um, it was a very pleasant Christmas. I don't have memories of many of my recent Christmases. I was looking at some of my photographs uh, and sometimes I just go and take pictures and sometimes um, I'm just recovering from something. So this was a, a pleasant way to spend it with mom and friends. Um, went to movies uh, and just had some downtime. Because this coming year, 2010, 2010, is going to be a big year for me in terms of change, in terms of life direction, in terms of building relationships, in terms of um, sense of self, uh, which are all big things. I think it's all stuff that we work on, on a constant basis, but I have taken uh, a considerable amount of time in this past year. Um, doing things I've wanted to do and um, so now it's time to find a home it's time to find a center it's time to um, build a place that I can feel comfortable going where my bed lives people ask me all the time where do you live and I'm like that's not an easy question for me to answer People want one word or two words, and I don't have them. I don't. I've spent time in, in South Carolina. I've spent time with mom in Dallas. I've gone to see friends. I've traveled across the country. I've gone to the valley and spent time there with friends. But all of my stuff, my world, the things that make me feel like I'm at home have not been part of my world for a while, and that... Um, at one time was okay, but right now it's not. So I'm very much at a point of needing that. So um, I'm very aware of myself, knowing my needs. Um, and I have a number of them right now. Um, so those are things I will actively begin uh, to pursue. Another being a job, a career. I need to uh, make some decisions. I need to really start looking at options in that regard. So um, even at this stage of life, I don't feel trapped into, into um, old 
things. So there's lots on the plate, but I do want to share a couple things. I'm going to try and keep this short. First of all, um, I went to a reception at the White House over the holidays, which was so cool. Um, thankfully, I missed that storm that y'all had, but um, went in, met the president, met his wife, um, just schmoozed at the east uh, wing of the White House with carolers and quartets and food and drink and a really diverse and interesting group of people. It was it was way cool. It was something I'll never forget. Really, honestly, it was it was it was awesome. Um, and I got here to Charleston to find that they had sent me a Christmas card. See, this is what the that White House Christmas card looks like. And it's an American Greetings card. American Greetings. Not in China. American Greetings chart. And they signed it on the inside. Again, I don't know if that comes through, but I was very proud um, to be on this list, to have received this, um, and uh, hope that I can help more in the future and in other ways. I think I've helped in what I will call structured ways in the past. Um, but I don't think that my my work is done. In fact, I know it's not done. It's just taking on a new a new context. Um, I also have a ring. See that ring? It's from Pinky. Um, and that replaces a ring that Elizabeth gave to me in, um, in February on my birthday. When I turned 50, she gave me a ring. You may remember, um, I found out I had melanoma, and she gave me this ring, which was very special to me. Um, and I went away for a week to do some hiking before this surgery, and while I was hiking, someone broke into the car and stole our purses, including the ring. And I was devastated. I mean, honest to God, I was just broken, and it was hard to accept that violation, but also, the, it, was, it was more than a ring to me. It was, a, it was symbolic of a number of things. Um, it was part of the, one of the most special days of my life, and it was gone. Somebody took that from me. So all year long, I've been looking to replace it, um, not in the same sense of what that other ring meant, because this one doesn't mean the same thing. Um, I chose this ring. Um, I Things are a little different now than they were then, um, and so the meaning isn't quite the same. But at the same time, I, I have a hard time allowing someone to take something from me that had that much deeper meaning. So this ring doesn't have the same meaning, but it has meaning. And I feel a sense of comfort and of closure um, having gotten it. So um, I bought it for myself. Um, and that's that. But that's really it. I don't